Hey, would you buy a phone with no branding at its back but still pass hand spec like many other flagship phones? Well, comment down below so I can also know about your thoughts. A forefather of Android has brought his new invention to the world of gadgets. His name is Andy Rubin. You may not be familiar with his name, but he is very famous. And his creation is known as Essential. Hey, what is up guys? This is Idiotic Idiots and let's talk about Essential phone in this one. As claimed to be the most anticipated and hyped phone of the year, the phone was pretty much underrated. But on the other hand, under the name of Bezel-less phone, Essential phone has made its spot pretty well. Well, if we are talking about the Bezel-less phone, let's just quickly come to the display of the device. The device comes with a 5.7 inch display with a small cutout at the top for the front camera, which according to me is quite nice, but let's just come to that later. And it also have a chin bezel. Let's come to the build of the device. The device is made of titanium and ceramic, which the company claims that can sustain drops pretty well. Well, many company have claimed that. Let's just see what they have packed for us. The edges of the device are made of titanium. The back is made of ceramic, and the front is covered with Corning Gorilla Glass 5. Well, coming to the internals of the device, the device is packed with Snapdragon 835 Octa-Core chipset with a GPU of Adreno 540. Nowadays, maximum flagship devices use the same processor. The phone is rocked with 4GB of RAM and have a storage of 128GB. It does not have a SD card slot, so a 256GB variant would have been a nice option. It supports Bluetooth 5.0 and also have NFC enabled. Well, sadly, there is no headphone jack in this one. The battery on the device is 3040mAh, which is less as compared to other flagship devices. But still, it has USB Type-C with fast charging enabled, which will make it quite manageable. The device packs with all the necessary sensors which a phone should have. The fingerprint sensor is placed at the back of the phone. The company claims that it is the fastest technology available. The device also supports wireless charging. Now let's come to the key feature of the device nowadays. That is the camera. At the rear we get a dual camera setup with the sensor size of 13 megapixel each. One of the sensor is a dual RGB plus mono camera with image fusion technology and the other is the true monochrome sensor. The lens has f1.85 aperture. The camera also has phase detection and laser autofocus. It is capable of recording up to 4K at 30 fps. The front facing camera is the 8 megapixel shooter which is very well placed in a small group at the top giving a better design to the device. The lens has f2.20 aperture. The interesting feature here is that it is also capable of recording 4K at 30 fps. Well, one more key feature of the device is the modularity. Yes, it supports mods just like the Moto mods. The pins at the rear of the device is used to apply mods. Well, right now only one mod is available that is the 360 camera. Well, it is a pretty exciting feature to see. The Essential comes with four different color options. Black Moon, Pure White, Stellar Grey and Ocean Depth. But for now, only Black Moon and Pure White are available. You can buy the device for $699 or you can also add 50 bucks to it and can get the 360 camera mod with it for $749. Check out their official site, links are in the description box below. So this is all for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Thumbs if you liked it, subscribe if you loved it, as it will always motivate me to do more. Also leave a comment below telling me your thoughts about Essential Phone. Will you buy it or recommend it to someone else? This is Idiotic Idiot signing off. Talk to you guys in the next. Peace.